What's up everyone? It's Reese and today we're going to be going over geometry. This video is specifically going to be about the triangle congruency postulate. So, first off, SSS is the first triangle congruency postulate and this stands for side, side, side. So side times three, just three, three sides. So this one is if three sides of one triangle are congruent, to the corresponding three sides of another triangle, then both the triangles are congruent. So that's side, side, side. Now let's move on to side, angle, side, which is SAS. So side, angle, side, and if two sides and the angle of one triangle are congruent to the corresponding two sides and angle of another triangle, then they are Therefore, they are congruent. The next one is angle side angle. This one is, is if two angles and one side are congruent to other two angles and one side, then the triangles are congruent. Next is angle angle side. This is if two angles in non-including side are congruent to the other two angles in the non-including side. Lastly, we have the HL theorem. This is if the hypotenuse in the leg of one right triangle this is if the hypotenuse and the leg are congruent to the other hypotenuse and the leg of another triangle. So now we're going to move on to some examples. So here are all the examples. I'll give you a second to figure out which one is which. So the first one is side, 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 because these sides are congruent to the other sides of the triangle. Let's just imagine there's another triangle there. This would be angle side angle because the two angles and this same side. Then you have angle angle side. The two angles and then the opposing side. Then you have side angle side. The two side and the included angle and then you have the HL theorem with the leg and the hypotenuse. I hope you understand everything in this video. If you don't, make sure to comment down below and I answer any questions. Peace.